Hey folks, Alex Beef. No, here I had, wasn't planning on doing a taste test again this soon, but uh, I found something at Target Friday night. That, that just This is also kind of a makeup for the lack of other stuff we're going to be having on the channel this week because here in Merca uh, it is Thanksgiving week, which means I got crap to cook. So uh, I'm going to have stuff to do all week and I'm going to be busy and stuff. So anyway, I went to Target uh, to get something to munch on. Friday evening, and I found uh, a chocolate bar, Wild Ophelia Crafted American Chocolate, 41% cacao rich milk chocolate, milk chocolate bar made with beef jerky and alderwood smoked salt. Did I fucking stutter? <laughs> beef jerky. Run wild, live free, eat meat chocolate. Yeah. Um, and on the back here, I'm, my glasses are out in the car. Uh, Wild Ophelia is a fair trade, non-GMO American craft chocolate line that celebrates American entrepreneurial, entrepreneurial efforts, it's been a long day, and diverse cuisines, <laughs> like meat chocolate, <clears throat> through its all natural and often organic ingredients sourced from small farms and artisans. Wild Ophelia's founder, Katrina Markoff, developed the brand as a tangible representation of her mission to inspire, empower, and help activate the next movement of female entrepreneurs. To honor its commitment to support American female entrepreneurs through its chocolate, Wild Ophelia donates a percentage of its profits to organizations that fund such women. Our beef jerky is crafted on the plains of Idaho. The cattle are raised in lush green pastures. They are accustomed to crisp, clean air and wide open spaces as nature intended, and have never received growth, growth hormones. Flavor profile. Natural smoked fruit woods and peppered spices perfectly match our rich milk chocolate. Okay, beef jerky is not a thing you would normally think of as a perfect match to milk chocolate. But stranger things have happened. Uh, the Moe's Bacon Bar, for instance. If you've never had that, my God, you've got to get a hold of one of these things. It, it's exactly what it sounds like. It's a chocolate bar with bacon bits in it. And it's really, really friggin' good. Um, run wild. Live free. And uh, to be fair, they, they do donate money to good causes, and they do have flavors that don't involve meat. <laughs> now, should it be necessary, of course, as it is a standard procedure on the taste test, we have the palate cleanser, tang, I guess today. And um, if need be, we also have the super palate cleanser. <laughs> That will also erase all memory of this from my mind. But, uh, let's, let's open it up. I'm kind of watching the cats, but not really. They, uh, one of their predecessors, uh, was a cat named Spaz. Ble God rest his little goofy soul. This is the only cat I've ever seen that liked chocolate. Not only did he like chocolate, he was absolutely bug nuts about chocolate. I mean, you couldn't open up a chocolate muffin or a candy bar or a Hershey Kiss without having this cat all up in your business. What the hell was that? Somebody on the roof? Who knows. Okay. So, um, might as well just get a nice big piece here. I'm just It's already melting on my fingers. Nice and creamy. Nice, uh... Doesn't really smell meaty, but, uh... Hmm. Okay. I like the bacon bar better, mainly because of the texture. Uh, with, with the bacon bits, it was a crispy, crunchy kind of thing. Uh, the jerky is just kind of disappearing into the chocolate here. But um, hoping to get a a chunk maybe. Hmm. No, I mean, I mean, I can taste that there's meat in there, but it's not the same kind of little, little spark, meat sparkle <laughs> that you get from the bacon bar. It's good. Um, if I offered it again, I would not turn it down. So, uh, okay. All right. Well, I, I will finish this up. Oops. There's another piece there. Um, hmm. Oh, no, there's a chewy, a chewy bit. <laughs> mm-hmm. 
Okay. 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 Um, no, it's not like, there's not hunks of beef jerky in there. It's pretty finely chopped, so. Yeah, it's not, not like they took a Slim Jim and dipped it in chocolate. Okay. Oh, that was a, that was, that was an experience. That was interesting. And again, they support a good cause. So yeah, get you, get you a Wild Ophelia chocolate bar. I think they have one with the potato chips. I think they have just plain. But uh, anyway, happy Thanksgiving, all you Merkin viewers. And I will see you when I see you. Take care. Bye-bye.